What's up guys, this is Default Within here, and we are back to Oblivion, and this is part 5 in the series, I believe, and guys, I really apologize on my other videos, uh, they were really long, I know that, and they're, the reason why they are like a half hour long was because I was trying to split those videos into two parts, and that didn't quite work out in my favor, but I mean, it was still good to watch, but, um, but speaking of um, quality, the audio in the videos, I uh, noticed that um, you can hear a buzzing noise. And the reason being is my settings on my mic, they were a little um, sensitive. So what I did was I went to my computer and then I went to my mic settings and then I turned down the volume like a little bit. So hopefully you guys can still hear my voice and you guys can still hear me. But um. Hopefully it's like better quality than what it was before. So if you guys can leave me positive feedback or pff, anything really constructive criticism about the audio, uh, let me know. But um, yeah, we're going back to the gameplay here. Uh, we did level up, so I went to bed. So what we gain? Strength. We gain a little strength in our skill, willpower. Affects how quickly your you regenerate magicka. Uh, governs the skills, um, agility, speed, huh, endurance, personality, I think we'll, we can choose three skills, so we'll go with speed, I guess, um, actually, we'll go with willpower, and then we'll go with, I guess we'll go with strength, maybe, And we'll go with um agility. Actually, no, we'll go with uh yeah. I guess we can go with agility. I guess just because we can. Did we level up? Yeah, we leveled up. Just making sure. <laughs> All right, so we were going to kill uh a wood elf, I believe, named Banelin. And we had to try to kill him in an accidental manner, meaning dropping a head mound on him. <laughs> that way we don't really get exactly in trouble. But yeah, um, this is part 5. I don't know if I said this before, but um, this is definitely going to be a long playthrough. So if you guys are new to the channel and this is the first video you guys see, um, Please, if you like Oblivion, The Elder Scrolls, Skyrim, I play those games. I play Soul Calibur 5 as well. And I've been thinking about doing some Halo 4 commentaries of some topics I would like to talk about. About anything really. And yeah, if you are into that kind of stuff, hit that subscribe button because um, I would like to think my channel's different. I don't like to say it's uh by most by any means like other channels that post call of duty <laughs> so if you guys are into different stuff come subscribe to the channel if you like the content and yeah should be pretty good so we're gonna we need to travel oh yeah all right i'm still getting a little used to the map here it's not like Skyrim where it's like easy maneuvers but um okay so this is definitely not the way I don't think where is the way if I could find it is it somewhere around the map oh yeah it's over here surprisingly I apparently discovered this area I don't know how but um I thought I would actually have to explore and discover that area. Alright, so what time is it right now? It is 4... He said around 8pm to 11pm, that's when we have to loosen the stuff. So we definitely have to wait a few minutes or a few hours before we can attempt to kill this guy. So hopefully we do this right because I don't want to reload the save and retry. Um, 
Um, yeah, it's it's a pretty easy lock. All right, I'm gonna wait. Um, I'll, I'm gonna guess whenever this is gonna be. Yeah, but um, I did mention that in my last video that well, actually no, I don't think I mentioned this in my last video, but I really want to bring something new to the channel. You know what I'm saying? Like, I really want to bring like I know I've been bringing different stuff to the channel, but it's just like putting my videos out there, which is kind of a little hard to do. Actually, I'm gonna save real quick just in case I get caught. Well, I did notice on my YouTube stuff that the video that's been most viewed was my Skyrim video when I was killing the Ebony Warrior. That's got more views than my Soul Calibur video, which is unbelievable because that video was my first video that I uploaded. And the reason why I got so much amount of views was because Varos commented on it. But the Ebony Warrior video got a lot of views. That might actually be my most viewed um video so I've entered Balance House if I can access the second floor cross space and loosen the fastenings on the mount head between eight as he rests in his chair doesn't all right all right so we are going to have to go somewhere in the second floor oh I have a lock for this Good thing I have that spell. Alright, so we're gonna have to find a way on the second floor to loosen the mounted head. Uh, this is gonna be really tricky. I cannot get caught by Grom, the dude's bodyguard. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right way. Really gotta be careful what I'm doing. Yeah, I don't think this is the second floor. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, I think it's this way. I gotta be very careful, because I don't know where is um Where is the crawl space? That's where I wanna know. If I can find the crawl space, I'm pretty sure I'd be pretty good to go. But yeah, I'm a little scared. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, maybe we have to go this way somewhere. Oh, there he is. <laughs> There's Grom. I'm guessing. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't catch me. Yeah, I don't know where to go. Where's the... Uh... Is it somewhere in the basement? Did I miss something? I don't think so. Uh, should we go through? Yeah, we're, we're just gonna go through this door. Hopefully. Oh man. There we go. Okay, so apparently this is not the right way. <laughs> yeah, we just totally like exited out of his house. <laughs> um, that 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 was not smart. Where where's the crawl space? See, you know what I should have done before I recorded this? I should have definitely looked this up on YouTube, watching other people, um, do this, because. I have no knowledge of this game at all, so I'm just kind of approaching it uh, kind of freely without any guidelines, so you guys must understand. Yeah, okay, so this is definitely not the right area. I don't know where...
Did I loosen it? I don't know. It said activate. Gee, I don't know. <laughs> There's Grom. Okay. All right. Oh, okay, crawl space. There we go. I knew that was a hidden door. It just kind of looked a little fishy to me. We'll close this. Be a little sneaky. And here we go. Yes, remove the fastenings. <laughs> there we go. What time is it? Oh, no. Oh, did we... Oh man, I think I failed the bonus, guys. Oh man, I'm gonna have to reload that. Alright, so at least we know where we have to go. Alright, so it's 10 17 p.m. Alright, we gotta go back. Gotta go back. <laughs> so hilarious watching me fail at this. Alright, we got time. We definitely got time. Go through here. Go to crawl space. Uh, go through here. Close the door. Loosen the fastenings. Yes, remove it. And he's dead. He's dead. That, that, that's good, huh? <laughs> yeah, I retrieve my reward. Good stuff. Oh god. Holy. Holy crap. Uh, yeah, we gotta run. Not get caught by this guy. Oh, we gotta go out, out of the, the back area. I think that would be the best way to get out. Yeah, alright. So that's why the back exits there. I was afraid I was going to get caught by his bodyguard, Grom, but good thing we didn't get caught by him. Sweet. Alright, so we should have got the bonus from there. Pretty sure we should have. The map. I keep on forgetting where the Dark Brotherhood is exactly. Like, the map is so small, I have to like scroll everywhere. Pretty sure there's a way to zoom, I just don't know how. <laughs> um, Dark Brotherhood, where are you? I know you're here somewhere. Oh, alright. It's probably somewhere this way, maybe. Alright, yeah, right here. See, I'm still trying to get used to the stinking map. Because <laughs> Skyrim, it was like, pick your location, travel here. Here it's like, I don't know. It might sound like I'm complaining a lot about this game, but I'm really not. I'm just uh, kind of comparing, which probably isn't a good thing. Makes it sound like I'm kind of bagging on this game, but I'm really not. So, don't take it like that. I really like this game. I wouldn't be uploading this if I didn't like it. <laughs> so, yeah, we did Um, we did it, hopefully. We got the bonus. I'm pretty sure we got the bonus. Because if we didn't, uh, I'll be pretty angry. Probably rage quit. Smash my Xbox, maybe. Nah, not really. I wouldn't do that. 
some some of my friends were actually um talking about smashing their Xbox and buying a new one, which I don't really understand, but <laughs> okay. If you want to do that and pay some more money, go for it. I mean, I really don't care. <laughs> yeah, my friends are kind of random. <laughs> uh, you guys have to understand if you guys are watching this, I'm not here to make fun of you. <laughs> hey, Vicente. That's your name, right? So, the accident has been staged and Bainlin lies dead. Well done. You have more than earned your reward and bonus. I present to you this dagger. It's an enchanted blade known as Supperthorn. Its prick is deadly, I assure you. Yes, you are quite an asset to this sanctuary. In fact, I believe you are ready for advancement. I hereby appoint you Slayer. Slayer. Well now go, child of Sithis. Go and rest. You'll need it. Back for more? As always, you fail to disappoint me. Your target is a dark elf named Valen Dress. He thinks he's safe in prison. He is tragically mistaken. A prisoner recently escaped from the prison using a set of secret tunnels connected to the Imperial City's sewer system. It's a perfect way inside. Just outside the Imperial prison is a grating that leads to the sewers. It has recently been tightly locked, but I will provide a key. It should be easy enough to locate Dreth in his small cell. Besides, I think you know the way, hmm? <laughs> Yep, I sure do. For many years. His tongue is sharp, but his body is limp and frail. He will prove an easy, pleasurable kill. You will receive a bonus if you fulfill the contract without killing any of the prison guards. Now go, and may the Night Mother go with you. Sweet, we got better stuff, I believe. Uh, Sephathorn. Look at that shit. Oh yeah. Wait, I think I forgot to... Oh yeah, I forgot to wear this. Black band. Uh, resist magic, sure. I'm not really gonna wear the shrouded armor. Sweet. Alright guys, this was part 5 of my Let's Play. Um, if you're new to this channel, come subscribe for more Let's Plays. And we'll be doing our next part of killing Valandreth. Without killing any guards. This is probably going to be very interesting. So um, yeah, if you guys could leave a like if you guys enjoyed. As well as commenting. And like and favorite, you know, as always. And I'll see you guys next time. Laters and goodbye.